What do you say to young men who come to you for advice? I say that life as a man is exceptionally difficult. I say the most beautiful and the most terrifying thing about being a man is you're born without value. Society doesn't care about you. You're only going to be cared about based on how useful you are. You have the chance to build yourself up and become a superhero if you're prepared to do the hard work and be indefatigable enough to never quit. But if you're going to stand around and wait for a handout, nobody's going to ever respect you. And I think that a lot of people have forgotten about how difficult and how competitive it is as a man. We're always in constant competition with each other. And it's your duty as a man to stand up and say, I want to be as important and strong and good-hearted and God-fearing as possible. And I need to work hard to achieve those things. And the dangerous thing about overly emotional men is that they're dangerous. They're genuinely dangerous. This is what's crazy. All these people who talk about toxic masculinity and how bad it is for men to be traditionally masculine. A traditionally masculine man does things he doesn't feel like doing because it is his duty to do them. He charges into the burning building because it is his duty. Not because he feels like it, because it is his duty. We're now teaching the new generation of men that they don't have duty and they can just act on their feelings and act how they feel and they don't have to act as a man should. Do you know what happens when you get men who just act how they feel? You get school you get violence, you get Men who do not control their emotions are dangerous. If you find a man who is stoic, he's not going to hurt people. He's going to sit and think about his actions very carefully, and he's going to be a good man who protects for it and provides for his family. If you find a man who just acts out on impulse and does whatever he feels like, you're going to find a dangerous man. Sitting here telling men to cry more and act with their feelings and it's okay to feel this way, that way, etc., and have no self-control. That is why we have the problems we have in the world. Absolutely nutly wrong. So when they talk about toxic masculinity, they have it completely inversed on its head. Completely nutly wrong. We need to be teaching stoicism. We need to be teaching young men to understand that the world is very, very difficult. It's hard to be a man. You're going to feel bad sometimes. You just suck it up and perform anyway. Not to sit there, you cry your eyes out, or blame other people. Tough or being call a out. woman too in modern society. It's certainly tough being a woman, but I'm not a woman, so why would I speak on issues I do not understand? I'm a man. You can feel an empathy for women. I feel empathy, certainly, but I do not understand their issues.